Now that we know that transformer layers take as input vectors, the natural question that arises for language models is how to represent text as vectors. We can use a naive idea and see how far we can get. Namely, we can first look at all words we have in a training corpus and make a vocabulary. So we give to every word a word ID and to each word ID we give a unique word embedding. But then the obvious problem with this is that we will have a finite training corpus. So at test time, when users interact with such a model, we will have the trouble of new words and also obviously there will be typos and all of these new words will map to an unknown token and will have the same word embedding and this is not a good semantic representation. So the solution here is tokenization. Tokenization means that we compose the vocabulary now out of subwords, which we will call tokens, and to have common words as part of the subword vocabulary, but to split rarer words into subcomponents. In the worst case, basically each character in the word will become a subword. 